Okay guys, I'm sure everybody already knows about this and I apologize, I just didn't have the time, but over here in Baja, California, in the Gulf of California right here, you had that 6.2 magnitude earthquake. And again, as I said guys, you know, anywhere, anywhere, any, any area that touches the Pacific Ocean, okay, the Gulf of California touches the Pacific Ocean. Okay, any spot of land or body of water or anything that touches the Pacific Ocean heads up permanently. Okay? Permanently, guys, to the end of this age. Okay? And anybody that's followed my videos for any length of time knows that any time that we fall below 5.4 magnitude earthquakes for two to three days you're always going to get a big earthquake somewhere on this planet a 6.3 is a decent sized earthquake I don't consider it large but it is big okay 6.2 is a pretty good sized earthquake if it struck you know in the middle dead center of a major city it would do extreme damage okay but it is a big earthquake it's not massive and it's not large it is big okay and, and as I've said anytime you go days below 5.4 magnitude you always get a big earthquake always you know I've got several videos that show you the patterns how the earthquakes operate how father's doing it right now okay it's going to increase at some other point in time I don't know when but this pattern has held true for over three years now it hasn't changed any time that we go two to three days below at or below 5.4 magnitude we always get a lar a big earthquake of some kind every time guys it never fails one day in the future it will fail because it will take less than two to three days before a big one snaps but for now until it does change that is the pattern and that pattern has held true for three years so this 6.2 magnitude should have not been a surprise to anybody anybody that's subscribed to this channel that's been following through the videos okay because I've got several videos I got a, a like a two or three part series that goes over the, the patterns the earthquake patterns and tells you that shows you exactly when a big earthquake is going to strike. It's always two to three days after we fall down below 5.4 magnitude. When things when things seem to be calming down, that is when you got to have the biggest heads up. That's when you got to be the most alert. When things seem to be calming down, that's when the big ones strike. Every time. Okay. So this shouldn't be any surprise to anybody. But just in case any of you hadn't heard about it. I just wanted to quickly make a video. Uh, yeah, I don't really have time to get make a long video where I can go over a whole bunch of things about the flooding that's going on uh, in Illinois and all the various things around the planet that are going on right now. I just don't got the time to do it. But I, just in case some of you didn't hear about the 6.2, I just wanted to go ahead and bring it to everybody's attention that we did have a 6.2 magnitude earthquake. And right here locally, uh, as far as the United States, it's just right there in the Gulf of California, just to the west of Mexico. Uh, to the east of Baja California and about 49 miles it's about six miles deep in the water or under the water and about 49 miles from the uh, first town in California so not very far in distance or anything of that nature from uh, our hometown or from our home area the United States Central America or North America so anyways guys the heads up again it will always continue it will continue to the end of this age as far as the entirety of the Pacific Ocean okay and uh, anywhere that you have these canals where the water is going to have to have a hard time moving, transferring from here to, to the Atlantic or from the Atlantic to the Pacific or from the uh, Pacific into the Gulf or whatever, you know, those are always going to be areas of, uh, of interest, you know, to keep your eye on as, as time moves forward. So, you know, but anyway, you know, this same area that where the Panama Canal is, is, is touching the Pacific Ocean. So you should expect earthquakes anywhere in Mexico and all the way down throughout anything touching the, the anywhere anywhere touching the Pacific Ocean including all the way throughout here because this leads into the Pacific Ocean guys anything that ha touches the Pacific Ocean is under a permanent heads up okay and it's going to hold true guys you know you're going to continue to see these all over ar around the Pacific from now to the end of the age and they're probably going to we're going to be seeing sevens and probably some eights uh, before too much longer 
So, anyways, guys, just heads up. I love you guys. Get in the word, stay in the word, and get the word in you. And I'll talk with you guys as soon as I can. Shalom to all.